We just arrived at Nusa Penida, which is an island that is a 30 minute quick little boat ride across from Bali. And situation here, we got Passport Heavy, Jabril and his crew are filming a Passport Heavy joint on the Nusa. Oh. Oh. There's a couple islands over here very popular destination and so he invited uh, a gang of entrepreneurs creators photographers filmmakers to come along and enjoy the Nusa experience so I'm gonna be vlogging behind the scenes kind of showing how they make a classic passport heavy joint as well as just kind of um, talking to people having fun and um, seeing how it goes. This is some blue ass water though and some blue ass sky. Beautiful day. Bless. So you guys, if you saw the Omnia vlog a couple weeks ago, already met Yuri, the wow. newest addition to the, the Passport Heavy crew. No pressure. No pressure. <laughs> Hashtag so no pressure. So before the whole thing gets started, how are you feeling going into this game, you know? You know what? what what's your game look plan? Look at all these people right here turning around. around. See, that's, that's a lot of pressure. Like, all those eyes on me. <laughs> but you've been doing this. How long have you been doing video? Um, probably for like three, four years. I mean, I always did it just for fun as yeah. a kid. and. Now I'm just taking it more serious and I've been meeting a lot of interesting people who give me a lot of interesting tips. So Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, taking All right. it more serious now and here we go, next connection. level. Yeah. First passport heavy joint. And uh, yeah, I'm sure you can click somewhere to watch it if you haven't if you haven't yet. Yeah, I'll I hope it was be, good. I hope you yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Young Yori follow me on um, Instagram at Ola. Hola, Hola super easy. Ola. Hola. It's the uh, videographer in Bali. Right. All right, let's get it started. Woo. We are just checking into our hotel for the next two nights, and this is the view. Nice view, guys. All right, so this view you can see it in the reflection. This little uh, bungalow goes for about 75 bucks a night, or by the month, about 750. And the view is not bad. For the behind the scenes, yeah. on the Noosa shoot, I wanna know too, what do we got in store for this whole weekend? So the crazy thing about Passport Heavy, I never really know what's going on. I let yeah. the squad know, so if you talk to Arnold or Tatiana, they know a lot more than me, but from what I know we're going to, we have this tour, it's all about the top Instagram spots, because Noosa Panita, yeah. the only thing I know about it is the thing that looks like a dinosaur head. Yeah. Uh, we're rolling back to Bali on a yacht, so that'll be, that'll be a vibe. Um, we took the speedboat here, a little different vibe, but you know, it's still cool and experience. Just vibes, man, but the, the main reason I brought everyone out was a lot of entrepreneurial friends, um, people making stuff happen, and that's the beautiful thing about here. It's a Thursday, yeah. you know, we're all in Bali, most people are like under 30 or at least under 35 years old, making things happen and making money from their, you know, their laptops, their cell phones, and they have the freedom and the flexibility to be out here, so, and everyone's paying their own way, no one's like, so it's, um, it's just a beautiful thing of people, yeah. like minds coming together, and that's more of the purpose of the trip than really. The activities are just a thing that we can hang out and you know go see these different yeah. beautiful places, um, but it's more of just like a, more of a mastermind to you know, even just connect with everyone. Yeah, for sure. This is a classic demonstration, again, of what's possible. You know, you have a bunch of friends, everyone has their own business. On a Thursday, you can just go do a trip on an island, somewhere tropical, maybe get a yacht, maybe not, do some funny shit, like, it's the life. Living that life. <laughs> so while we're at it, while he's holding the camera, I met this dude 
if you don't know about him, the one and only Mr. Alpha Shed himself, <laughs> Aaron Darko. So I met this guy in a cafe in Chiang Mai like a couple oh, years yeah, ago. That's right, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So you know, it's part of the Chiang Mai gang, you know, part of the digital entrepreneur gang. I got my timeline. <laughs> um so yeah, if you don't know about him, look him up. Fitness entrepreneur, digital entrepreneur in general. So like what are you working on mostly these days? So I'm helping the entrepreneurs get their mojo back, man, get in shape. Yeah. You know, a lot of things stem from your diet, right? Like your nutrition, like yes. habits and stuff like that. Yes. Like um, if you procrastinate in one area of your life, chances are you're procrastinating in other areas of your life. Similarly, if you have bad habits in one area of your life, they're also going to be bad habits in another area of your life yeah. as well. So, you know, getting that discipline and it starts with nutrition, right? So, for example, today, for example, what's the yeah. time right now? It's like, what? Yeah. 1 30 p.m. 2, yeah. 2 p.m. Yeah. and I haven't eaten since um, last night 9 p.m. yeah there you go so it's just and I've had opportunities to eat and drink and all that kind of stuff but yeah it's just a discipline that you train over time yeah. similarly in your business you have certain things you do every day in your business that move the needle it's the same thing in nutrition so it's about um, yeah. basically bridging the gap between health and business right mm. There you go. So that's it. Yeah. 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 Check him out on uh, Instagram and on YouTube. Mm -hmm. And yeah, man, uh, it's been uh, it's been dope to see you uh, crushing it on Instagram. I've been following him for like yeah. the past couple years, doing big things. Look into him. And, and Riley's getting shredded too, man. Yeah, man. I'm trying to trying to get there. I see you that know. six pack, bro. You posted in the uh, group. I have my highs, my lows. Yes, I did join your group. Yep. Your alpha shredding. I was like, you know, I had to commit to something, you know, because yes. like we all like. Or like okay in our health uh -huh. and like you know translates to business as well, as well so yeah if you want to take your fitness to like if you're like in pretty good shape like an average guy like me like if you want to get to the next level that he's your guy yeah and that's the thing there's always a next level right mm -hmm. it doesn't matter where you're at there's like for me there's another level mm -hmm. i can pack up more muscle or i can get more flexible but there's always another level mm -hmm. so i'm just helping guys that are not at my level get to mm -hmm. my level yeah so that's it Fuck yeah, yeah. boom A surprise birthday party for one of the families here. Just finished dinner. Oh my god. All right. I have to be respectful. Bro, I'll take the fucking moped. <laughs> Alright, so everyone was just chilling upstairs, eating, chilling, talking, and now Jabril got a gang load of bikes. And we're about to uh, take a little cruise. Get <laughs> a ride, cowboy. There you go. We're always chasing Jabril like that. Dude, day one. I need to break my arms ring. What is this? Yeah. This is also what you don't see on every passport heavy video, on any YouTube video for that matter. Is getting out the drone, the drone. So what do you have to do? What's the checklist? So right now I'm changing the um, the, the filter. Changing the filter. So I can get uh, you know hide the reflections. It's I'll like say. a polarizing filter. According to the lighting. To, yeah. Okay. Good lighting. Um, oh, cool. All right. Making Good. sure it's right. Yeah. Um, and then I'm gonna launch it. And then you're gonna fucking blast it off. You gotta make sure that shit's right first. Four K. It has to be future proof. Four K, twenty four FPS.
everyone, the light is coming to an end. So your your light is ending, which is your 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 life source, literally. So day one, takeaway. How you feeling? How was it? Feeling pretty good. Got some good shots. Uh, interesting ideas. Got a lot more ideas for tomorrow. So yep. exciting. All right, yeah. I think that was a solid uh, day one, but we just getting started. That was nothing. That was, yeah. Tomorrow's when the real fun starts. Like what, four more days of shooting? Yeah, like that? we got wow. like a full five days out here, so it's gonna be good. So what's happening? What's happening, Mr. Passport Heavy? So um, people always ask me this, and this is actually a big search question on YouTube: is how do you make money from YouTube? So you were just mentioning it. How do how do YouTubers make money on YouTube? Well, I'd say if you get a lot of views, um, which I'm not in that category yet, <coughs> or with, with, you know, with, with building up. So before the most like I ever to make like is a hundred, two, three hundred dollars um, a month from YouTube views. Yeah. And so if you want to monetize, you know, you're gonna have to do maybe some affiliates, or if you have products, if you have merch, um, it's a lot easier to monetize that way. Um, recently, started getting like a thousand, two thousand dollars a month from views, like. Right? I'm over the moon with that because yeah. for years that we've been building the channel, never had anything remotely close. And um, so I think that's one of the biggest misconceptions that people have. They're like, oh my God, you're getting so rich from YouTube views. And yeah. I was like, unless yeah. you're such a big time um, person on YouTube and you're doing millions and millions and millions of views yeah. monthly, yeah. you, you're 100% not making bank from just the view. But yeah. if you're doing millions and millions and millions of views a month, you know, you can make bank, but that's such a small, small percentage yep. um, of people. Yeah, the real money comes from having your own product, affiliate links, sponsored deals, and growing your brand. That's what I say. And so, if you don't know what we're talking about, so YouTube will pay any creator um, a, a certain amount of pennies per thousand review, views. So, one million views is about a thousand bucks. So if your channel is now making around a couple grand a month, that means every month is consistently, all the videos combined are getting around two million views. So this takes time to build out uh, like tons of videos that are just like floating around YouTube, constantly getting views. And so, but this takes years to finally get that little source of passive income. Like my channel is like around $200 per month just from YouTube. If you watch YouTube, you'll see ads come up like on some videos. That's what we are essentially getting paid a certain amount of pennies per thousand views. So that's what we mean. But the real money comes from building your brand. So that's how you do it. 100%. But, but anyway, congrats. Boom. 100K subscribers. Pass what heavy. If you ain't subscribed, click subscribe, man. In all my food porn videos, I have never used a light. Oh my God. So you never see this in any passport heavy videos, but Jabril goes into his in the zone mode and he's working on his phone. Working right now. Thank you. <laughs>